Hi, this is Bill. Day two of Cedar Key. This is the uh, the second day of our Cedar Key trip. We launched at the same place, the Cedar Key Beach, City Beach. Yesterday we went to Etsina Odi Key, and then to Snake Key. Today we're going to go to. Seahorse Key and then to North Key and uh, Seahorse is 3.26 miles from Cedar Key Beach and North Key is from Seahorse is 2.02 miles and then North Key to Cedar Key is 3.51 I believe woke up this morning just as I was getting ready to leave, leave the hotel we, I looked out at Seahorse, Seahorse and uh, um, it was raining I thought oh great but no rain didn't rain all day even though it looked like it was going to kept the cl clouds kept the, the sun off us and 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 that is a little humid, but it wasn't bad. Water was fairly smooth, and uh, it was a good paddle. I fell behind. I was having trouble with my my shoulder. I was paddling wrong, and I was tired from the day before. But uh, once I got out to uh, Seahorse, we uh, we rest of the minute and I got back and rid of the things and shoulders stopped hurting. But it was a delightful paddle. It was just, we saw a few porpoises on the way out. Saw the fishermen working in the area. The commercial fishermen also the recreational fishermen and, and that were probably right here in the in the main channel. It was probably the main channel for Cedar Key back in the back in the day when it was a port for the uh, for Swanee River. And straight ahead is well now we're at Sea Seahorse Key and I'm going to take a break. When we got back in we kept noticing these little wakes of fish going on. Found out that they were they were bonnethead sharks. Which they're small sharks, they're three foot. And they go out to the crustaceans and all that. But we saw a load of them. There was just every couple feet we went, it seemed like we saw one. But uh, this island has a uh, lighthouse, and we uh, saw the steps to go to it, but it was closed off. The University of Florida has has a research facility out there, an educational facility, and uh, they have it closed off. They opened it up a couple times a year for for um, an open house, but we didn't. We weren't lucky enough. I think we missed it by two weeks, but it was still a great paddle. We paddled along the outer outer edge of it. Saw uh, eagles and egrets and herons and and a lot of other things. I think we did see a, green, a turtle on the way out, and then we made our way to North Key. And uh, on North Key, we saw a, a colony of white pelicans. I have a couple, I think I have a still shot of them at the end of the video. I thought I might have them on the video, but I didn't. And, uh, it was, it was, a, it was a nice paddle. Good, good, 
group of people and and uh, great day for paddling again. Not too sunny. I think the sun did come out between North Key and and back to Cedar Key, which is the opposite. Yesterday in the morning we had sun and then cloudy all day. Now we got cloudy and then sun in the afternoon. But didn't rain. Didn't get wind. Didn't get kick up too bad. It was just that that front came in and it just hung around for a couple of days, which probably was a good thing. But we get to North Key, and I think we have lunch. Yeah, we ate lunch, and then headed back, headed around the island, and then headed back to Cedar Key. Again, a great paddle, had a blast, and uh, hope to do it again soon. Hope you enjoy the video.